Uh, committee, the state law has already passed. Committee is now waiting for full action in the uh, House in Harrisburg. Meth is one of the most dangerous and addictive illegal drugs. All this week in a special series of reports, we've been taking a close look at the local fight against meth manufacturing. Well, a new program called the Meth Hunter is targeting pill shoppers in an effort to shut down meth labs. 12 News' Emily Matson has more on how state lawmakers are helping and how prosecutors are benefiting. This dramatization, based on a true incident, shows the dangers of cooking meth. The chemicals and mixtures used to make methamphetamine are highly explosive. It's reasons like this why State Representative John Evans problems, uh, has been a strong voice against the, the meth residue. problem so, in our uh, again, area. Uh, meth has been an issue in northwestern Pennsylvania uh, over the past decade. Uh, thankfully, the laws are in place now that make it a much tougher crime as far as the punishment is concerned, and I think the, the individuals that are dealing in meth understand that. And there's now another tool in the fight against meth. The Meth Hunter is a software program that aims to stop meth manufacturing. We're looking at very significant reductions in the meth supply, up to 60 percent, and also a reduction in the purity of meth and uh, an increase in its cost to probably about the same ratio. The program keeps track of pill shoppers, those shopping around pharmacies for pseudoephedrine, the main chemical used to make meth. I think it's a great program and using technology to get more eyes and ears in the field to help law enforcement in dealing with this issue is extremely important and I commend uh, the people involved for uh, getting this process underway and hopefully it'll pay off in results. The Erie County District Attorney says when it comes to prosecuting these meth manufacturing cases, the more evidence they have that will prove someone was involved in the meth making process, the easier it is for them to get a conviction or plea. But in terms of the, uh, the manufacturing aspect, the ingredients are what, um, what help the prosecution. If we can uncover uh, all the precursors, the, uh, the LAG, the liquefied ammonia gas, um, any of the other ingredients, we know that we're onto something. Making any efforts to catch these meth makers and shutting down meth labs in our area a positive move. Emily Matson, WICU 12 News. Now, uh, one local law enforcement agency is already seeing benefits from that uh, program. Tomorrow, in part four, we'll talk to the chief of the Girard Department, police department, to see how it's uh, working there. Let's go outside.